Do you want to talk a little bit about just the different kinds of drone that are out there, like on battlefields today? Because it's not just like, you know, I'm sure people are familiar with the DJ, DJI, like, you know, fly up and have a camera and whatever. Um, what what are the different ways that they're deployed today? And what do those different requirements mean for something like your product? Yeah, it's a really good question. I think the like coolest, like flashiest kind of drone is like the kamikaze, like the one-way attack drone. And there's can... usually FPVs? Yeah. Okay. Um, and so you can make those really cheap you can make them for like under 500 dollars um you can 3d print them then there's also and this is what the dgis get used for a lot like isr drones so like intelligence surveillance reconnaissance um those are really really useful actually like just gathering intel um they can be very useful in like telling you where your artillery has hit um yeah th those get like a ton of use and then i think what what we're seeing more of now in in Ukraine as well is like these kind of one-way long strike attack drones that can go hundreds of miles and those are like effectively like a missile basically mm. and so so those are kind and are of, those like carrying payloads that they drop and fire separately or they're, they're not kamikazes they're not you see people are literally filling up like basically Cessnas filled with like explosives and like sending those like very long distance um and I I, I think that that's like a capability that we need to we need to further develop.